I have another charging accessory here. This is a 1 amp controller for lithium ion battery. This is very, very tiny. It's about 25 mm by 19 by 10 millimeter. And I have just connected it to test it. And I am charging this cell phone battery. 3.7 volt lithium ion battery. I'm using it to run the fan. And in the back here, I have a solar panel. And I use the solar panel to charge this lithium ion battery. I realize for lithium ion battery, it is better to have a controller to control the charge because if you don't, it can catch fire, it can overheat, it can explode, it can do a lot of things. Actually, um, it's been working out very well for me. I can charge this for about two hours or so and I get to about 4.2 volt and then I would stop the charging manually. But if you want to do it right, you would need a controller like this. Supposedly when it is charging the light would be red and when it is charged the light will be uh, will be green. For some reason the board here this light is blue instead of green. I'm assume it's uh, 4.18 is close to fully charged maybe that's why it's blue and when it is charging it should be red. Um, got it from China similar to something like this this is another board and you have the USB here the input it is capable of controlling up to 1 amp so you can use different kinds of lithium ion battery this one like I said is from my old cell phone it still has some charge but I didn't want to use it because um, a new battery would give my cell phone longer talking time but this still have a lot of charge in it that's why I'm using it to run this uh, fan of mine this board here is very inexpensive I got two of them they're about a dollar fifty six or less than three dollars Free shipping from China got it maybe in two weeks so I thought I would make a video of it 